say hey, everybody. Head over to the visitor center. Carter, where are we? Can you say Saturday? Day. <laughs> Welcome to Saturday Plantation. Cabin, so it's like all the way over there. It's part of this building over there. What is it? The smoke house. What do you think would go in there? I don't think the bathtub. It does look like Beat. meat would hang from the ceiling. You think? What do you think that machine is? You get all the fibers out of the time, they would have to use those cars right there, these blue cars right there. You get all the fibers out. Those almost like dog brushes, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> they could be, but I think they're supposed to be like blue cars. You're supposed to get like, like okay. Yeah, that's a spindle. And that's live, that's a soap. Soap they use when they get out of line. They have to make their own soap. And then brands too. They didn't have fresh soap like they do now. You mm -hmm. just go to the store, you go to Walgreens and buy all kinds of soap or body wash. Your lye soap was harsh on your skin. Definitely. Carter, like are you walking on the front porch of the house? <laughs>
had a little bit of cotton and of course you know they had to grow their own fruits and vegetables. So we just got out of the mansion and I couldn't video anything in there because it was photography only so I will insert pictures of the inside that we walked through here. It is pretty loud. Okay. Okay. What do you think they would use that for? Calling the slaves to do work. To do work and to what? Symbolize what? Yep, and to dismiss them. Yeah, but look, well, see, that's how they... Eight years old, uh, <laughs> we boys, we worked uh, 10 hours a day, 10 cents an hour, and uh, in the summer when it was dry, we would, uh, we had a Model A Ford truck, we would carry six barrels of water, 50 gallons of water to a barrel. We had a Model this A This is what an 11-year-old would do. Would this is your age, water, right? 50 gallons and this is what they would do all day. And we carried the run, drive Working the life of an 11-year-old at Sodderly. And water, all the flowers, and work around their flower beds and things like that. And then, say 12 or 13, I was out in the fields with Uncle Walter Bob. We was cultivating corn on a salted cultivator. Hey, I thought this was in my own this morning. Hmm, what is that? Flaxseed. Flaxseed, you can do it. We have to do like eight buckets of this. Junior Barber. Yeah. Four Barber's son. Is it pretty heavy? And he and I oh, used yeah. to yeah, it's hunt together, heavy. rabbits, I think squirrels. I found it because I will drop and it. And then in the summer, <laughs> we would go down. Yeah, tobacco barn. They would hang it until it dried. And then make it into. And then they could make it into cigarettes, yep. So we had a really good day at Satterley today and came home and I had a ton of laundry to do. Sorry about the big bright light. It's also six o'clock at night so the sun's starting to go down here. It's really low in the sky. Um, but I just, we came home and I almost didn't take the kids to the homeschool day today because I had so much laundry to do like so much laundry to fold up and put away. When my husband's on nights, it's really hard for me to do any of that during the day. What is your problem? Because he sleeps. So I actually came home from Saturday and found my husband awake folding the laundry, which was really nice, but really makes me sad too because he got up at one o'clock to fold the laundry and he has to work tonight. So it makes me really, really sad that he did that. Now I was very thankful for the help, but just sad that he did that to himself. <coughs> Carter, stop sticking your fingers in your mouth. Let me see if you can catch his reaction when you ask him where he's going. Every Tuesday when Shay has soccer practice, I drop her off and then I go and hang out at my sister's house because she doesn't live far away and it's so much easier than chasing a toddler over all around the soccer field for an hour and a half. So. And I get to hang out with my sister, so it's kind of cool. But let me see if Carter will do it. Carter, 
who are we going to see? Riley. Riley. Stop sticking your fingers in your mouth, you weirdo. Where are we going? I love that. Who are we going to go play with? Riley. Riley. <laughs> Carter, you probably shouldn't run with the stick, bud. Um. I feel like I always forget to end the vlogs, and I'm sorry. I have to put all this laundry away. I'm going to watch some Criminal Minds and then I think I might take a nice hot bath because everybody's sleeping but me or I might just go to bed. I haven't quite figured that out yet. Which one I'm going to do yet. But thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed it. You saw a little bit of a homeschool field trip for us and the kids playing and we had a really great day. So now I just have to catch up on house stuff. So I don't know. Thanks for watching guys.